Francis Tiafoe received a negative response from the O2 crowd during Roger Federer's farewell doubles match at the Labor Cup. Francis Tiafo felt the wrath of the crowd at the O2 Arena last night during his Labor Cup doubles match against Roger Federer and Rafael Nadal. The U.S. Open semifinalists produced some aggressive returns during the Swiss Maestro's farewell, including a fearsome forehand late in the 10-point match tiebreak. Federer was hit on the arm by a 98 miles per hour winner from the young American to go 8 7 up in the match tiebreak. The world number 19 was then subject to boos from the raucous audience, and the star put his hands up to apologize. On a separate point, the 24 year old nearly took out Nadal with another speedy forehand, this time while returning a Federer serve. The shot went down the line and the Spaniard, who was standing at the net, was floored as he narrowly escaped being caught in the face. That brought up a match point and Tiafo, along with Jack Sock, defeated the legendary duo 4-6, 7-6-2, 11-9 and leveled the score for Team World at 2-2 at the end of Day 1 at the 2022 Labor Cup. Federer's last ever match was complete and he sobbed as he was congratulated by Team Europe at the end of the pulsating encounter, and the camera soon cut to Nadal who was caught up in the emotions of a truly special evening. Nadal wept as they embraced each other in the middle of the court and the 20-time major winner shared a moment with the rest of the players from both teams. Then, in arguably the most moving visual in the history of tennis, both Federer and Nadal were sat next to one another courtside as they continued to cry while two-time Brit Award winner Ellie Goulding performed. After a sensational 24-year year career, Federer has now bowed out from the sport and gave one of the most emotional on-court interviews ever to be seen as he thanked his colleagues and loved ones. It's been a wonderful day. I'm happy, not sad. It feels great to be here. I'm happy I made it through, he said.